Yeah, I mean, he's a, he's a big guy, right? Powerful guy, athletic for that size. He's got uh, an incredible motor. Uh, you don't see a 300 and, you know, 35 plus guy move and, and um, you know, able to play the amount of snaps that he can without, you know, getting tired, you know, so that's a, a huge benefit for him. He's very intelligent. Uh, he wants to be great. He's driven. Um, you know, I think that it, he really hasn't even scratched the surface yet, which is a little bit scary, but um, he's, he's going to be a dominant player. Uh, you know, another guy that's made a huge jump is Mason Graham, too. I mean, he, he played a lot as a freshman, but, you know, the production um, will come, but his movements, his block destruction, his pass rush has all improved, and he's a phenomenal, phenomenal uh, player as well. I'm not sure. You know, it's my second year here, um, you know, and for the last, whatever it was, 20-something years prior to that, 25 years prior to that, I was really kind of diving into my own world wherever I was. But across the front, and really even the front seven with Junior and Mike B and Ernest Hausman, and then the edge position with, um, you know, Braden and Derek and Jalen and Josiah, I mean, it's in Rayshon Benny and Cam Good. Like, there's guys we can send waves at people and keep them fresh. But, you know, also know that there's this is a long season, too. So having having guys um, that'll be there at the end of the season, knowing that you have that kind of depth, um, you know, it's it's been a very, very impressive group for sure. And I guess I should have expanded it, obviously. Uh, you haven't been here for yeah, years, but I, I mean, anywhere you've been. Anywhere I've been, yes. This is as good of a front that I've, I've had to, you know, the privilege of coaching, without a doubt, across. And I mean, from end to end, to uh, even that second level, and it's uh, it's an impressive front seven. Well, I mean, obviously he's playing really, really well right now. Um, I think his ability to just continue to get the snaps and, and, and the fine details of, of playing that position and coming off the ball, you know, coming off the ball a little more consistently and attacking um, but he's so big and he's so strong and, and, and his arms are so long that he just he's able to get off blocks, you know, relatively quickly and uh, which leads to the high level of production that he has. So, um, you know, I'd like to see a, a more consistent get off and, and things like that, which will be better for pass rush and better for knocking people back. And, and he knows that. I mean, he knows that that's something that he needs to work on. Um, but once that becomes consistent, I mean, he's going to be a, a wrecking ball out there. Guys like Chris Jenkins and yeah, it's a great group. It's a fun group, and, and we have a lot of fun, and that's part of this, right? You're, um, these guys spend 350 days out of the year trying to get their mind and their body ready for the, the 15, 16 Saturdays we have an opportunity to play on. And, um, you know, they're, there's great personalities. They're fun personalities, but they, uh, you know, they're very professional in how they approach it, which is great.